In this video, I'm going to show you how to do this really awesome text fade on and off effect right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro. So, let's get right into the video. So, once you are inside of Adobe Premiere Pro, you want to begin by creating a brand new sequence and in order to do that, we are to go up to the file button on the top left of the Premiere Pro we will go into a new sequence and it's really important here that we go into settings and we make sure this is a frame size of 1920 by 1080 this will ensure the video is 16 by 9 and 16 by 9 is the aspect of a widescreen video you can also rename this by click here and type the name that you want and then click OK and now we need to generate some text so I'm gonna go file new legacy title we will press OK on this window and in the legacy title window we can type out whatever we like doesn't really matter so for example I will type millennial I'm going to change the fonts and I will increase the weight of this, increase the size and then I'm just going to center this up using two center buttons and then drag the title one onto timeline from here we can go ahead and select title one I will go to effect controls go into the opacity tab and just go ahead and select the rectangle mask button now we are just going to drag that all the way over to the left and making sure the text is now visible then increase the height this mask then I will increase the weight of the mask Then I will move this into two seconds and I will move the position of the mask over to the right and making sure we are refilling the text. So we should be able to see the entire word that we just generate. Now we play this back we've got this text refill effect happening but the problem is this doesn't look very soft at that moment you can clearly see the end of that mask it's clearly defined by this harsh line just here so we select the title one once again and go into mask one and we are gonna increase the mask feather to a really high number around 200% now when we play this back that should be a lot softer and there you go we've just done the soft fade in and now to do the soft fade out all you need to do is same process but just exiting rather than coming in so bring it into three seconds create brand new keyframes on max path and then go one second to the right click mask 1 and we will drag this mask all the way to the right of screen now if we play this back from the very beginning we've got the text fading in and fading out the soft fade in and fade out is really easy but really awesome effect right inside of Adobe Premiere Pro that utilizes masking so if you like this video you can tell me in that comment section and also share and subscribe this channel for more tutorials. See you on the next videos.